Will the Valentine's duo of Dark Cupid and Love Light crush the hearts of their enemies? Well, in this video you're about to find out. And that begins in... 3, 2, 1... Welcome back to Bean Gaming, my last The House video, I did a showcase on Dark Cupid, so we have that urn, but I did not have the 2500 broken hearts needed to get the Love Light urn. I grinded, what floor did I grind? It was 7-5, grinded that like crazy, got the 5 game win streak going, and just got those broken hearts over and over and over again. Finally, we passed 2500, so let's go ahead and clam our Love Light urn, purchase success, that's amazing. And we're going to go ahead and open that urn. My luck in this game has actually been really bad lately. So I'm not expecting to get a, a shiny or anything like that. But we'll go ahead and open. Does it? Uh, let's go ahead and open right here. And that's a cool looking urn though. Kind of nice. Love light urn secret. Okay, that's cool. Let's go back to our heroes. Let's take a look and we'll type it L-O-V. Love light. 2.5k exists. I'm late to the party. But let's go ahead and view. And... She gives a 10% boost for Dark Cupid. She's wholly human, so that's kind of cool. And speeds 3, damage is 1750. We'll go ahead and try and get some kind of curse on Love Light. And I'm not going to waste too many skull curses here, but we'll, we'll see anyways. So we're at 1246. Let's take it down to about 1240, maybe 1230. I don't want to do anything crazy. Dark Vision, Haste 2. Maybe just give me a 1% possibly. Okay, Oblivion's fine. So we're going to hop on in game here and check them out together. Here we go.
So let me know what you think in the comments down below. Is this a dynamic duo that I would use on my regular team? No, probably not. It's cool that they came out with a couple additional heroes for Valentine's Day, Valentine's Week, whatever you want to call it. But otherwise, it was cool to grind for, I guess. And like I said, it's just something cool to have on your team. But if you don't get them, then it's not a big deal. I think they'd be pretty useful for people that are just starting out or maybe even mid-game players. But for the pro players or expert players, I would say probably not. Just go ahead and grab them and then move on. Keep grinding with what you're doing. Chapter 1 is coming to an end relatively quick here, so make sure that you get all your super punches together. Don't ask me for a super punch. Go ask Busy Grizzly. He has about 6,003 of them right now. And in the meantime, go ahead and check out my Roblox group for the Sweet Bean Gaming t-shirt, of course. The only 10 of Robux. I mean, come on. It's rich. It should go for like millions and millions of Robux, but not. And then, of course, you can join my Discord server. We're always chatting it up in there. Game night's going to be soon. Try and have game night once a week. So, once again, I do appreciate everyone's support, and I will talk to you later. Bye!